Hello everyone, please welcome and join me Easy Steps. Today I'm going to share with you Toshiba laptops or Toshiba notebook. Are you having a problem with the boot failure? I know that majority of Toshiba laptop have these issues. I'm sharing with you what problems you're going to see regards to boot failure. If say is a boot failure, a proper digital signature was not found one of the files on the select boot device was rejected by the secure boot feature. So, since uh, these are Toshiba laptops, uh, they are uh, getting uh, this feature into BIOS and that's one of the reasons we are seeing these problems. As I know how we can fix it, I'm going to share with each one of you, there will be no secrets, no, nothing, it will be all tips how to make our life easier in easy steps so what i'm going to do uh, right now i have this recorded that this is the problem we have i'm going to share with you now i'm going to go on my laptop now i'm back to my toshiba laptop if i start it once it started as soon as the toshiba comes in i'm going to press f12 so we press f12 the boot menu opens and uh, the first one is a USB, the second one DVD-ROM and third one is hard drive and fourth one LAN. And if I supposingly at this moment what the problem we are seeing if I press it okay I'm going to say boot through my USB which is bootable and it's saying uh, media fail is not doing anything. So what it's uh, basically saying that there is no bootable device and it won't allow me to do it anything i start again with dvd if i put my dvd in for my windows 7 desk and i'm going to turn it off once i turn it off i'll start it again and once i start it i'm going to press f12 and i need to bring my dvd the first boot so once you press F12 we're going to be in the boot menu once uh, pressing F12 we are in boot menu I'm going to scroll down all the way to enter setup and I'm going to go all the way in boot once I'm here in boot I'm going to see my first one is USB the second one is DVD so I'm going to press F6 to bring it up so now I'm going to press F10 to save it. Once I save it, I'm going to say yes and I'm going to let it boot. Once it's booting, it's checking media and it keeps failing. And that's saying please restart the system. No bootable device. And this is what I'm getting and boot failure and proper digital signature was not found so I was getting that so in order to fix this problem I'm going to share with you what exactly you need to do what I'm gonna do I'm going to shut down the computer first thing you need to do once we shut down I'm going to start it again as soon as the Toshiba comes I'm going to press F12 as soon as I press F12 you need to go all the way down and you say enter setup you need to go to security once you are in security if you say the secure boot is enabled if you look in my finger it's enabled I'm going to hit enter and I'm going to select disable it's already disabled and now I'm going to go on my boot I'm going to bring my USB the first drive so now we can do F10 once we do F10 you will ask for saving changes yes and once you do that I'm going to plug my USB into uh, the slot and it's a checking media and we disable the secure boot but it's still causing a fail because it's not uh, looking for bootable device please restart system now the best and the easiest way to fix this issue let's turn it off again let's start it I'm going to start it again 
I'm going to press as soon as Toshiba comes after all once we are here I'm going to say enter setup okay on the main then it's a security we already secure boot disabled now the most important part you need to go under uh, advanced once you are in advanced you need to go system configuration if you see system configuration I'm going to say click and that's where if you see that UEFI boot boot mode is enabled so I'm going to click that and I'm going to select CSM boot so once I will select CSM boot I'm going to say hit enter it's changed already I'm going to press F10 I'm going to say yes it's going to boot up and it's going to work without any problem so we're going to see what's going to happen it's going to look for now the windows 7 and uh, initially it was uh, uh, blocking everything you wasn't able to do it now we're going to say it's a dvd is picking up and it's a window is loading files and that's how you fix it uh, your toshiba problems uh, with the boot failure window is loading file is starting windows and now we are on screen welcome windows 7 so that's how it's easy to fix your computer toshiba if you're having boot failure problem i hope you like this video if you think it help you out Please make sure that you like, subscribe, and share. And I'm going to see you soon with the new things. Best of all, easy steps. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.